Have you ever realized in life you always stands out amongst your family and friends? You ought to be the last one, but you are the one leading others. It means you are the chosen one. But your family, members, friends, and people around you will develop jealousy, envy, bitterness, and hatred towards you. I am going to talk about the five reasons why the chosen once are mostly hatred. I will ventilate on ways to deal with the hatred if you are the chosen one. The plan of God is to give you a good life in line with your destiny. Those that hurt you can't stop God to do what He wants to do in your life. In this journey of life, people want to know what is happening in their churches, in their schools, in their community, in their marketplaces, including knowing what is happening in and around your life. If you are a chosen one and you have the favor of God upon your life, people will start to hurt you. The chosen ones are people which God has given an assignment to do on earth, and their star always shines even if they are among many people. They do not want to be noticed, but because of the gift of God upon their lives, the light of God is always with them, illuminating their lives wherever they go. If this is happening in your life, it shows that God has chosen you and He has created you for a special purpose. Number 1. Reason they hate you is, you are way better than them. They do not have a reason for living. Even if they have more money than you, you cannot see anything tangibles which they are doing with their money. Number two, reason they hate you is, they want to be like you, yet they will never be like you. So they will inflict a lot of pain in your life. Their hatred is because of their inner issues, and you are not even part of that. They want to take away what is in you because you are the chosen one, and even the devil cannot do anything about it. They gossip about you because of their low self-esteem and inferiority complex. They get satisfaction by hurting others and gossiping about others. They want to take away your pride by talking about you behind your back. They gossip about you so that they can be seen as better than you. Yet in reality, they have a character in deficiency. They paint you black, and yet you don't even know your background. Because of the favor that you are carrying, they will try by all means to influence others to see you the way they see you. Success people don't sit down to gossip about people, but seek for ideas to move forward with life. Remember, the more they gossip about you, the more God promotes you to the next level. Number three, reason they hate you is they see in you what they do not see in themselves. So they hate you because they want to make you feel useless, make you feel that you are nothing, and make you feel worthless. The honest truth is they know that you are special, that is why they hate you. The light that you are carrying is attracting insects, which are poisonous. If you were not carrying that light, no poisonous insect will come near you and nobody will hate a you. But because of what you carry, which your enemies are seeing and you are not seeing, they hate you. It is important to know who you are so that you can function according to God as plan. Number four, reason they hate you is, when you are around people, your presence is felt and the atmosphere changes. It makes them jealousy, but they cannot do anything because you are carrying the favor of God, which makes you different from them. You are superior to them. You have been chosen and you are the chosen one. Number five reason they hate you is, they want to control you. If they see that they cannot control you, they will feel inferior. They want to control your life and move around the community, telling people that you are who you are because of them. If you live your own life, they are not happy and they will hurt you more. Those that hurt you, one day they will come to bow down to you. Never enter into an argument with such people because they are not on your level. Don't agree to be reduced to a lower level by such people. They will continue their bad behavior and they will end up thinking that they have power over you. Live your own life, talk with confidence and continue with your life and leave them alone. They are not your problem. Leave them to deal with their low self-esteem and internal issues. They don't like you because they don't like themselves. Don't expect to be liked by everyone. Live your own life and let your haters be your motivators. If you find this video helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more motivational videos. Your support means a lot to us.